Hi everyone, welcome to my video series called Porn and You. My name is Catherine Lyle and I'm a men's health and porn addiction specialist in Bayside, Melbourne. Today we're going to talk about how porn addiction has been swept under the rug with all the other sexual wounding in society, yet it's now at epidemic proportions and a global health crisis. So hi, and thanks for joining me today. Um, now let's deep dive into one of the biggest issues facing us with this ep epidemic. You don't know what you don't know, right? Education is everything in this space. There are scientific based studies and research uh, studies everywhere on the impact that porn is having on men and on society, yet the majority choose to stay in the dark. And even when they do know what the damages are, they're still choosing porn over all else. And that's because it's a neural addiction and it has, ta has taken hold. But whatever you're not changing, you are choosing for yourself. Most of you wouldn't have guessed um, that you have a porn addiction or that it, there is such a thing as porn addiction. You definitely don't see yourself as addicted or an addict. Um, and because no one is filtering down this vital information to the people, how else would you know that this is a major problem? Any female that brings it up is called a bitch or a feminist for trying to deprive men of their God-given right to have this constant visual sexual stimulation in their lives because men love sex, right? But it's 97% of men that are watching porn regularly and all of those men have a porn addiction, right? So just get that into your head. Society hasn't even flagged it as an issue up until now. Although Google, Google is full of white coat studies and brain scans, no one has filtered it, filtered it down to the people. The erection clinics, the dysfunctional clinics, the doctors, they're still blaming smoking and age and weight for erection issues. Their solution is Viagra, to eat more fruit and to walk regularly. Like seriously, what the fuck? But over 90% of men that I see that watch porn have erectile dysfunction, over 90%. It's called porn-induced erectile dysfunction or PIED and no amount of exercise or berries is going to uh, help you if you're watching porn regularly. Remember when smoking used to be cool and sexy? When people used to smoke in offices and restaurants and cars before it killed a gazillion people? The men don't understand the impact that this is having on their bodies, on their minds and on their behaviours. They don't tell their mates, they don't ask, their dicks don't work because they're too afraid to seek advice. The women, they have no idea how much this is affecting the men and their relationships and they're afraid to address it in fear of feeling needy or nagging, even though they feel inadequate and hurt by this destructive behavior, they're still not speaking out. They fear that their partners will choose porn over them when it comes down to it. But guess what, ladies? They already have, and they just can't see it. What have you got to lose if you've already lost your partner to porn? Hey, communication is key here. Stay tuned for another video that I'm gonna make soon around this topic, giving you advice on how to actually approach this conversation uh, you know, with a partner. Sexual dysfunction, mental health issues, no sexual energy, disconnected sex, inappropriate behaviors, brain damage, erection issues, premature ejaculation, no focus or concentration, no direction, memory issues, lack of judgment, sexual violence, relationship breakdowns, lack of emotional expression, communication breakdowns, other addictions, secrecy and shame, domestic violence, and suicidal men. But you didn't know, right? Well, now you do. You can't pretend anymore. I'm offering 10 free coaching calls today, so if you'd like to step up and claim that spot, one of those spots, then send me a PM. Uh, I also have an amazing 90-day program called Awaken Your Sex God, where we not only get you off porn, we make you more sexual and get you back connected into life, and life changes immensely when that happens. 
I also do couples therapy as well. So if you'd like to get in touch um, on how we can work together to, um, to conquer this issue together, basically, uh, send me a PM. Anyway, I'll talk to you soon. Have a great day. Bye.